So how do you get social proof? Social proof is like a, a press release. So that's like there you getting in the news for the right reasons. We have detailed training on how to do this. But that's like um, you're featured on war. You're featured on maybe like the uh, local newspaper. You're featured in Fast Company. You're featured in Fox. You're featured in Bloomberg. Let's try one more and see, Stu. Let's go to like 13 maybe. We're going to find one. Let's try 13. If we can't do it, we'll just put the brakes on it and we'll just move on. 2013. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, Warby Parker. Work with me. <laughs> work with me, Warby. Oh, just work with me. Oh. Okay. So you go to the site here. They'll start to develop a little bit of like news stories. They'll start to develop a little bit of like uh, kind of like a a story that they have some traction. So what happens is, is that they on the site, their story becomes like a big thing. So if you click there on the story, and we'll let you do that. Can you click on the story? And if this doesn't work, we'll just go. Wah, 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 wah. Okay. What are we? What are we looking for? I'm looking for their story. The top right, the top there it says our story. Click on that. Okay. Our story. Yeah. yeah. It could be an epic fail here. Let's see here. Um, anyway, you go on here and it tells you their story. And what happens is as their story catches on, they want to get more and more people to know what their brand is all about. And so they did a lot of PR early on. And if you research Warby Parker, you'll discover they were in the New York Times. They were in um, Fast Company. They were in all these. It's really important for them yeah. to get some kind of media coverage. So, Stu, if you Google real fast uh, Warby Parker and then like uh, let's Google like New York Times. Yep. And then maybe put 2013 after it. Yeah. Yeah, let's see here. And there we go. So anyway, what happens is that the company's trying to get a lot of media coverage. Look how much media coverage they have, by the way. They're in Fast Company. They're in wow. New York Times. They're in all these different media features so that people, if they Google the name of the company, find these articles. Credibility. So if you Google Warby Parker and maybe Fast Company, again, if I've never heard of this online company, what would you do? You're Same gonna, thing. You're going to search for them online. You're going to Google right. Warby Parker. And if you find Fast Company articles about them or New York Times articles, that social proof helps you. Yeah. Now, now that they're big, I, I mean, they still do PR and media, but it's not like the, the, the number one most important thing anymore. But they have to establish some sort of credibility and traction. So it's very, very important on your site that you try to get those third-party trust symbols. Okay. Another example, if you go to EITRLounge.com, that is our uh, men's grooming lounge. And you'll see there we have As Seen On, Tulsa People, Journal Record, Channel 2. Um, those are big things. If you go to our photography company, EpicPhotosTulsa.com, right? You'll see, again, trust symbols there. If you kind of hover over them, you got the Not.com, TLC, Tulsa World, Tulsa People. So big names. You know, we've been featured on some things. Yeah. If you do, um, let's go to Thrive15.com. Perhaps you've heard of that site. Maybe you're on that site right now. Ooh. But if you go, <laughs> if you scroll down, we have, you know, As Seen On, and it yeah. just helps people know that you're a le legitimate uh, organization that people um, use and, and they know that you're credible. You're not going to rip them off, take their credit card. Yeah. So I'm going to go through kind of the checklist here. One is as seen on. That's a move. That's one of the third party trust symbols. You could say as seen on and then any media you've been featured in. And if we go back to the Wayback uh, Machine one more time, which is so unpredictable, and it, it stresses Stuart out because he's like, is it going to work? <laughs> is it not going to work? What's going to happen? Yeah. But let's go to four hour work week. Here we go. Going back in the day to Tim Ferriss, who started this company called the four hour work week. And I believe he Spells it out as four, but I think he does. Maybe. Oh, but you're right. Maybe. Let's see. So let's go to 2007. Yep, and then click on one of those. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Work. Come on. This tool. This is the kind of thing, Thrivers. You're trying to use this tool. It doesn't work. Nothing's nothing's worse than a public fail. There it is. <laughs> and it worked. That yes, works. let me find my effect. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. You have so many effects. You got to make sure you... Okay, there it is. So look here. He has his website, and there's no social proof on it right now. It doesn't say... Well, he has one, yes. Phil Town, number one New yeah. York Times bestseller. Yeah. But then let's skip forward just a little bit into the calendar, and he starts to get a couple media wins, okay? And he'll add them to his site, and you can watch him do it. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Well, what happened? Okay, here we go. Oh, oh it's not working, but we're going to make it work. It's going to happen, Thriver. Stay patient. And through the process of speed editing, we can remove time and space that it takes to pull things up. <laughs> yes. Keep going. Oh, yeah. Come on, baby. Keep going. We're grinding through. Keep going. We'll find it. Oh, the official. Oh, no. Come on, baby. Oh, come on now. You know what's happening is it's not loading those graphics at the top. That's what's yeah. happening. Yeah. 
But right there across the top, that's the as seen on stuff. It's not loading it right now for some reason, but he has like as seen on the New York Times, as seen on uh, Men's Health, as featured in Forbes or whatever. And those things work. So as seen on is very, very important. Oh, look at it. He had it. Number one uh, WSJ seller. Yeah. And New York Times bestseller. So you want to make sure you add that.